monster! See, here is your fellow Grey Warden. You worry too much, young man. You... you're alive. Huh. I thought you were dead for sure. Duncan's dead. Oh, oh shit. shit. Do not talk about me as if I am not present, lad. I didn't mean. But but what do we call you? You've you never told us your name. Names are pretty but useless. The chastened folk call me Flemeth. I suppose it will do. The Flemeth? From the legend? Zabeth was right. You're the witch of the wilds, aren't you? And what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? She got a point. We need to bring Loghain to judgment. Why would he do this? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadows darker than any tainted creature. Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it is the true threat. The Archdemon. By ourselves? No Grey Warden has ever defeated a Blight without the army of a half dozen nations in his back. Not to mention... I don't know how. How to kill the Archdemon, or how to raise an army? It seems to me those are two different questions, hmm? Have the Wardens no allies these days? I... I, I, I don't know. Duncan said that the Grey Wardens of Orlay had been called, and Al Eamon would never stand for this, surely. I suppose. Al Eamon wasn't at Ostagar. He still has all his men. And he was Kalen's uncle. I know him. He's a good man, respected in the landsmen. Of course, we could go to Redcliffe and appeal to him for help. Sure. Such determination. How intriguing. I still don't know if Al Eamon's help would be enough. He can't defeat the Darkspawn Horde by himself. Of course! Intriguing. Grey Wardens can demand aid from dwarves, elves, mages, and other places. They're obligated to help us during a blight. I may be old, but dwarves, elves, mages, this Al Eamon, and who knows what else. This sounds like an honor to me. So can we do this? Go to Redcliffe and these other places and build an army. <laughs> as long as some profit in it. <laughs> and when is it ever? It's always been the Grey Warden's duty to stand against the Blight. And right now, we're the Grey so you are set then, ready to be Grey Wardens. Now, before you go, there is yet one more thing I can offer. Oh, sure. Stew is bubbling, Mother dear. Shall we have two guests for the eve? Or none? The Grey Wardens are leaving shortly, girl. And you will be joining them. What? Such a shame. What? You heard me. <laughs> the last time I looked, you had ears. <laughs> have I no say in this? You have been itching to get out of the wilds for years. Here is your chance. As for you, Wardens, consider this repayment for your lives. 
Wait, wait, whoa, wait. Repayment for your what? Out of the wilds, she's an apostate. If you do not wish help from us illegal mages, young man, perhaps I should have left you on that tower. Point taken. Mother, this is not how I wanted this. I'm not even ready. You must be ready. Alone, these two must unite Ferelden against the Darkspawn. They need you, Morin. Without you, they will surely fail, and all will perish under the blight. And, and you, Morris, do you understand? If I give you that which I value above all in this world, I do this because you must succeed. Oh, shit! <sighs> Allow me to get my things, if you please. I am at your disposal, Grey Warden. Just a village north of the wilds is our first destination. It is not far, and you will find much you need there. Or if you prefer, I shall simply be your silent guide. The choice is yours. From the way he glares, I imagine that answer is clear. I just do you really want to take her along because her mother says so? I guess you're right. The Grey Wardens have always taken allies when they can find them. I am so pleased to have your approval. Farewell, Mother. Do not forget the stew on the fire. I would hate to return to a burned-down hut. Fine. It is far more likely you will return to see this entire area, along with my hut, swallowed up by the blight. I Positive I attitude! All I meant was... Yes, I know. Do try to have fun, dear. Dude. <laughs> oh shit, we leveled up. Cool. He... Can use more strength. Um, I need to get him at least a little more in there. Constitution, let's go more strength. Next. Combat tactics might be a good one, because he's got quite a few training. Yeah, let's go combat tactics, because we need another one of those slots. What's this? Okay, let's do that for now. Let's go to my character. Um, I need strength. Let's go to more. When do I get this? I want my ranger. Let's go Constitution. Love how my character has more terrors tankier than the other dude. Nice. What's this? Wait, why can't I have this? 24 dexterity? Oh man. Cool. I'm good with that. On that note, I will be right back after I conduct a save. Uh, my game totally just crashed on me. Where do I go from here? Oh, really, dog? <sighs> really? Really? Thank you. 
you want to have. <sighs> okay, now hopefully we can officially begin or continue. <sighs> okay, try to get comfy with that. Alright, uh, dude, interesting place. Right, where are we going? So she said. I guess 